Okay, I'm back to the SPM 100, and if you look down there, it says connected. Yay! Uh, Gun Tonic sent me a message and said, Reboot the phone. So I rebooted the phone, and lo and behold, it worked. So now I'm back down here giving this thing another test. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and calibrate the meter just to be sure here. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna take a reading. I've got my uh, hoses connected up. I'm going to go back to my external static pressure and start. Start, please. Okay. Uh, now you can see it's giving me the return pressure at a negative before it was uh, giving me a uh, an incorrect uh, it had return and supply were reversed uh, then when uh, the software was updated then I couldn't get it to work and that's where I got the uh, rebooting the phone okay so okay now I've got a reading on there notice I've got well, it changed now. Uh, it had a one point something reading on there. That was a little out of hand. I don't know what that was all about, but it did settle down. Total external static pressure is 0.17, sometimes 0.16. We'll call that point 0.16. Okay. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to my little listy thing, go to the history. Come on, history. Okay, now what I want to do is I want to export that to email. Let's take a close look at it. Uh, my total external static pressure is point. One six. Export the email. I want, want you to note something here. The total external static pressure is 0.06. Okay. Uh, 0.16 and 0.06 ain't the same thing. So I think we still have a problem here. Uh, I've tried this several times. Can't figure what I'm doing wrong, if anything. But that's what I'm getting. So I got it to work, but it's not giving me the correct total external static pressure. It emails properly and everything, but it still gives me that 0 0.06. So, uh, I'm afraid it's still got problems. <laughs>